Okay, so here's my bike arrangement and my boat hooked up and ready to take the Anmus River Trail back. And here's the, um, well, the end of it actually. And then there's the map that shows it. And it's self explanatory. Santa Rita Park, smelter, and I'll take it back past Rotary Park to the area of Chapman Hill. Boat probably weighs about a hundred and I don't know, 160 pounds with the bike on it. Of course, now the bike's off, so maybe it's 120. It's a, it's a heavy little bike. Um, it's a Schwinn Loop 7 and it works really wonderfully for this purpose because the loop becomes part of the frame that is the tow bar. Right to there. It seems very simple and it took quite a while to figure that out. But the only thing I have to do is clip off the safety. I have actually lost the boat one time and had it go off on its own. So like a, like a ski strap. And here we go. Okay. Here goes. the river and here comes the turn Okay, here comes the hairpin turn. Let's see if I can get it. A little sloppy, but there you go.
That was the easy part, and now comes the climbing. This used this hill used to be a bear, and uh, I got a longer crank arm and uh, a second set of smaller gears, and it's helped made all the difference. It still worked though. Get a fire going. The bike uh, works really well. I'm in the the uh, tow rig. It took some while to get, but uh, it seems to work really great now. And it's surprising how little effort it takes. Uh, I mean, it takes effort, but it doesn't take that much effort to move it. So I'm really pleased with it, and it makes for a fun day of boating and biking. Bridge and the usual takeout is right here. Coming up on you. I'm gonna play through, folks. Oh, beep, right. beep, beep. I gotta, yeah, yeah, there you go, guy. Not able to stop that easily. Hey, you have a good time. We'll see you, buddy. of the trail was one of the last to be built and it was quite a battle the owner wanted to get out of it from the city as much as they could and it's a good little climb it was an expensive part too because the whole thing is elevated They did a great job on that trail. This will be fun. Hey. How are you? Hey. Hi.
Here is a uh, serious Texas barbecue on a Sunday. What? Right. Yeah. <laughs> and downhill. Bumpy there. Here is BMX track. to do the bridge for the fun of it. They did a marvelous job on these bridges. Pedestrian bridges. Hey buddy, how you doing? Thanks. Santa Rita Hole, right down here. Favorite little kayak spot. The high bridge going over the highway. So anyway, that was Santa Rita back there, and this is Santa Rita Park coming up, and Smelter uh, Rapids coming up here. They've got a nice playground, and then Smelter, the actual Smelter for the town, used to be across the river, I'll point it out as we go further down. Sunday and not many people. Melter and corner pocket.
Sunday evening, not a lot of people here. Let's see if any kayaks or any, any boats coming through. Don't see any. It's all the play space in the rapids you could possibly want. section of the trail is really rough. It's one of the most heavily used and I, I hope they intend to fix it. This is the section above Smelter. That's uh, Twin Buttes, one of the Twin Buttes. That area over there used to be smelter. We got somebody going by right now. That area that's been reseeded and treed used to be where this where the mill was. Now Durango got its start when the train came in, which is immediately to our right on the other side of the freeway. Okay. Woo! Double Tree Inn used to be the Red Lion, and before that, it used to be Federal Lumber many years ago. And there you go. This is Albertsons and a hill. Gonna stop and do some shopping and then head home. This will do right here. <laughs> you all look like you had a good day. Yeah, had a great day. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> okay, here we go. Ninth Street Bridge.
Okay, that was 9th Street Bridge, and over here is the river. It's a Sunday, so there aren't many people on the trail. Local skateboard park. Hey. What a bunch of grumpy looking people. <laughs> Sunday and there aren't a lot of people here. I hear something grinding back there, but I don't know what it is. Yeah? bench. Lise Cutler. And here's the underpass under Main Street, Main Avenue. Built in 2005. Had considerable trouble and expense and a ridiculous amount of debating that went on for decades. But made this trail useful. Before you had to go up over Main Street, and it was a big pain. Rotary Park. And here we go. Train crosses over there. The last hill to climb. There's the railroad tracks. And one tiny bit of the trail they haven't finished. So I have to go right up the street. Pulling quite a load here with all the extra groceries. And the hill is steep.
Home stretch. Very good. Here we go. Anyway, that's the, uh, this is the home stretch. People still on the river. The orange light is, uh, the orange light is from the fires. The upcoming Durango uh, USA Pro Challenge starts right up here in uh, less than a month. It'll take off from here. Here's the liquor store we fought and couldn't get rid of. Hey! Hey, how you doing, Roy? Hi. Hi. There's Simba. And I'm home. So you can see the rest of it. Uh oh, here comes trouble. The entire neighborhood of trouble, all of them. You know, it would be easier for me if we just gave you the same first name, trouble, and then one, two, three, and four. <laughs> right? Don't you? Wouldn't that be? And you no. could just call me. Make Trevor Maple. <laughs> yeah, that works. Look at Simba. Uh oh. You know what that face means? What? I'm late. And his canned cat food is not. See how he's kind of sour looking? Yeah. Yeah, you know why that is? He, he wants his canned cat food. <laughs> and he hasn't gotten it. And I'm over 40 minutes late, so I'm kind of in trouble myself. <laughs> he got him in trouble. What are you guys up to? Having riding bikes. Cool. Uh, I just picked up all my groceries and none of the none of the popsicles are frozen. Does that make sense? Yeah, we'll freeze them. They're well, that's a possibility. We could go around a bunch of times and pick up them. No, I'm perfectly happy to have you do it, but they're not frozen, so you would get them not frozen. Okay. That's okay. I okay. can freeze them because I have a really, really good freeze. Okay, then why don't you come back? In the middle of the night. But there's priorities. Simba goes first, then I go second, right? Because I get my gin and tonic. And, th and then I will give you bags and, and uh, you guys can go pick up trash and I'll hand you out the, the uh, popsicles. I have bags. Do you already? Do you? Great. Well, why don't you go ahead? So, should just two of us share a bag? If you do, 
I'll be okay with that, but I, I want the bags to come with a reasonable amount of trash in them. Okay. Oh, you guys, you guys are allowed on the island, aren't you? Yeah. yeah. There's Did tons. Did the baby deer um, 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 die on the island? Say again? Did the baby deer die on He the died. Island? The baby deer died. The problem was the mom didn't know what to do with him. She was confused. She never had a baby before. And also, she could smell people had touched it. And so, just don't touch babies. Unless they're laying in the street and you have to move them, don't touch them. But anyway. We touched a baby deer. Yeah, you don't want to do that because your smell goes on the baby and confuses the mom. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yeah. yeah so if you want to go ahead and get the trash bags and we'll do one trash bag for each two people. Okay. Okay. Sure? Yeah, me and you. Very good. No, I want to do it. No, you two work together. You and Kiva work together. It hardly okay. matters. And you two work together. Whatever. I don't care. Okay. Bring me two full bags. Okay. So all of you work together. Okay? Can we ride our bikes while we're doing it? You can do whatever you want, darling. Yeah. Guys, move! I have, I'm having so much fun with this bike. If I yeah. get off the bike, I'll have to be walking. I know, they're totally great. It doesn't take much. Can you, can you imagine not having a bicycle? That would be a total bummer. Okay, so off with you. Okay, bye. I have to feed the cat and make my gin and tonic. Simba. And the kids pick up uh, trash in the park and I give them popsicles. Uh, so they want to earn some popsicles. There's Gay back there. And there's the river. Well, this is an island that we live by, and this is a back stream that goes back here. And it's time for a gin and tonic. <laughs>